GM underscore liminal underscore hotel has got to be one of the most unsettling and creepy maps in Gary's mod history. Now GM underscore liminal underscore hotel is a normal map at first glance. Everything seems alright once you first take a look at it. But the deeper down you look and the deeper you keep going is when the all creepy and unsettling stuff starts to appear. It is a map based off of the iconic and infamous at this point liminal spaces kind of subgenre of horror. In this map, you are in a confined space without seeing the outside world. You are all alone, yet there is something watching you. Or at least that's what it feels like. It could be your paranoia setting in. Or it could be that you have no clipped out of reality into the back rooms. Now that could be very fitting. Hell, it's Gary's mod. You could have totally no clipped out of GM Construct for all we know. Now this map gives a very heavy sense of dread, scopesthesia, psychosis, and paranoia. Now you might be saying, oh, well all Gary's mods maps give you that same feeling. Well, you are correct, but this map is completely different because in this map, your senses are, well, they're not wrong. That gut feeling that something is around the corner, that gut feeling that you're being watched from an upper room in the liminal hotel, that gut feeling that something is following you or watching you, well, they always say they trust your gut feeling, don't they? As you walk around the hotel with nothing there, you can try to spawn in enemies, friendlies, vehicles, any sort of AI to make you feel less lonely, but in this map, it doesn't work. You still have the overwhelming sense of dread and the overwhelming sense that you are being watched, even when you have friendlies nearby. Now, how does that happen? Now, I'd say it's because the force that is watching you, the force that is following you, is not of this world. It is not in the game world as it feels. It feels like it is watching you, not the player, not the in-game character. Yes, you, the person controlling slash playing the video game. And the only way to shake this feeling is by completely disconnecting from the server or completely quitting Gary's mod. But don't think that will save you, and don't think weapons or any sort of mods that have admin weapons will save you either. The only way you can save yourself from this force is by, as I said, completely closing the game. The feeling won't shake you immediately though. You will still be distraught. You will still be tense. You will still be stressed you will still be worried that it is watching you through the screen. You will still hear fluorescent lights flickering in the back of your head. You will still hear footsteps. Also, you will hear ambient noises even after the game is closed. Now, is that the psychosis or the paranoia kicking in? This map will not leave you the same after you play it. Even if you play it 500 times, you will still leave the map feeling the same way. Now this is why I feel like this is the most unsettling map in Gary's Mod, because it is absolutely terrifying, and even after you close the game, the feelings stay with you. No other map in Gary's Mod, or hell, in any other game has left me feeling this way. Now I will highly recommend that if you have Gary's Mod, you should totally download this map. It doesn't require any other games for the download other than Gary's mod. I will leave a link in the description for the map download. Please do play this map after the video is over because you won't understand what I'm talking about until you actually play it. Hell, you might not come back the same way. You might come right back to this video and you might comment that you feel a sense of dread 
overwhelming you and not leaving you. In conclusion, is the map cursed? Is the map filled with a hacker that watches your every move? Is this a setup for an ARG? I don't think so, but the map does such a brilliant job at making you feel like it is, that you might as well believe it is. Now please like and subscribe for more videos. And please like the video and comment if you enjoyed this video. I will see you guys later.